outside the Senate a show of support for the woman whose allegations have thrown the Supreme Court nomination process into crisis. I pledge allegiance to the flag. And a counter demonstration on behalf of the man she's accused of not being fit to judge others. Dr. Christine Blasey Ford told the committee she was a reluctant witness. I am here today not because I want to be. I am terrified. I am here because I believe it is my civic duty to tell you what happened to me while Brett Kavanaugh and I were in high school. And what she says happened was a sexual assault. I believed he was going to rape me. I tried to yell for help. When I did, Brett put his hand over my mouth to stop me from yelling. This is what terrified me the most and has had the most lasting impact on my life. Then it was Brett Kavanaugh's turn. He was clearly angry and at times emotional. For your coordinated and well-funded effort to destroy my good name and destroy my family will not drive me out. After I have been in the public arena for 26 years without even a hint, a whiff of an allegation like this. He said the allegations were completely unfounded. I swear today, under oath, before the Senate and the nation, before my family and God, I am innocent of this charge. The senators will now have to decide who they feel has been the most credible witness here, Brett Kavanaugh or his accuser, Dr. Ford. At least that's the theory. The reality is that party politics could still be the factor which determines whether Kavanaugh reaches the Supreme Court. And the Republicans remain determined to see their man confirmed. The Democrats equally determined to stop him. John Brain, TRT World, Washington.